Hello YouTube, I'm today I'm going to show you how to make a homing missile using an expression, target finder, vector thruster, that stuff. Okay, I don't know if I have the expression saved in here, I don't. But I'll write the expression with you guys so you can understand what it means. So first go to wire, expression 2, and set up new expression from here. Now you must input e entity don't forget it's case sensitive output v vector and persist a vector and b vector the inputs are something that the expression gets from other stuff from other ships and gates the outputs is what the expression tells to other gates and persist our values located in the core of the expression that aren't going in and out, they just stay there and help calculating. So A equals entity position. This means that A equals to the position of the ship. B equals E position. E position. This means that B equals to the position of your target and V equals B minus A. Well, these are pretty cool, but you can't forget this. Run on tick. Because this makes the expression update every second. I mean, every game tick, it updates. So the expression is always turning when you turn and going after you. Otherwise, it will just fly in your first direction. Now, get a PHX missile from PHX, useful and explosive props. I'm going to use this one, it's my favorite. You can use an MRAM, but I'm going to use this one. Now, you must place the expression up here so it's more accurate. Now, place. Uh, I think you understood the code, I think I explained myself properly. Must be toggled, value on 1, value off 0, toggle, whatever K you'd like. Place it in there. Now you need a target finder with the settings for your target. I'm going to target myself because there's no one else in here. And finally, a vector thruster. Shoot it on top of the expression twice. Now, wiring tool so we get this set up. Entity. Go to target finder, one and and mool equals that. And finally, vector equals the expression. Now, we have all this done. We've, we need a thruster under it to power it up, otherwise it will just eat many walls and stuff. Use some cool model so it doesn't just look epically ugly. I'm going to use this one because it fits under it. Now when you have this done, check your K, toggle on, must be, no sound, just don't bother people. Now press enter with it frozen to check if it's going on your direction. And this time it is not. It's a mess up between A and B. So this time you must set A instead of B. It's a normal thing, it happens, I never know why. So just switch A, B until you get it aiming at you. Okay, it's now aiming at me, you can see. Now, we don't want these things to corrupt themselves, it's so smart constraint. When you have this done, set the weight to 10. So it doesn't just go slowly. Now let's just do it the security dupe. Now let's test. Press 1 and freeze. This thing is buggy. Now press enter. And it's going down to your target. As you can see, it works pretty cool and you can now kill your homies. Hope you enjoyed. Goodbye.